Hello my friends, welcome. In the video about the heat gun, I have already shown you the different types of spatulas. Today, on this door that you have already seen in the video about the introduction to sanding, I will show you uh, the different angles and the different types of usage of these spatulas. So the type number one are these classical spatulas. In case you're using the heat gun, this here is the maximum length that you should be taking because it corresponds to the maximum width of one of the pieces you put on the, on the, on the head. And these spatulas, usually you use them for plain surfaces that you have seen in my demonstration in the atelier. So like this, you can use it like this. And here, impossible because it's too wide. Then comes the type number two. This is the, this little triangular piece. And this can also be useful when you're working on plain surfaces. And this is really for putting away what is staying. And the advantage here that as it's very rigid, uh, you will be able to remove more things than with the flat splatula. By the way, you can admire here how this door handle is straight, which wasn't the case at the beginning. If you want to know more about this, you can watch my video about how to put a door handle straight. And you see here the door frames, enabling me to show you a usage of the triangular spatula, which is that you can really reach the center of the corners. So this here is really essential because if you don't have this tool, you can't access these parts. And this gives me uh, the opportunity to show you the type number three, which is this one. And here it's the same. You have these um, piece which is uh, quite sharp. And here you can really access perfectly the different uh, parts which are not reachable otherwise. And there is also this rounded part which is useful as well because sometimes you have pieces which are round so you can use it also like this. So here you see how to use this rounded part. If this part, if the circle of the tool is too big, you can put a slight inclination and you will have exactly the right diameter for cleaning your door frame. So this gives me the occasion of explaining you the usage of the spatula number four with a strange shape. And this will be very useful when you are reaching corners like these here. Here you have access and this is thanks to this slight inclination it has at the beginning, at the front. So then you can just reach this little corner here. For a concrete example, I invite you to have a look at the video about the restoration of my workbench. You can see here I use a lot the flat spatula very useful for uh, using the heat gun and I then um, used uh, chemicals and then for removing after the chemicals made effect the paint I used the small triangle extremely useful and here it was on a big surface. In the second part I will now show you the seven doors that I renovated, seven doors, meaning 14 door frames. And I have to tell you beforehand that uh, I totally underestimated uh, this piece of work because it's extremely work intensive. And maybe it was also the case because I didn't know how to do at the beginning. So hopefully this video will enable to save you a lot of time. 
Before launching the music, let me just tell you that I hope that you like this video. If it's the case, please leave me a like or subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, see you soon on Happy Hour TV One.